Uh, we've been running since 2008. Obviously, me and myself has been running a little bit longer than that. I worked for a few smaller companies prior to starting my own company. Um, you know, I've done van work and did a lot of long-range van work when I was younger and then into small trucks, so probably since 2004, but Derby's have been operating since 2008. We're moving a little bit of everything at the moment, actually. We're doing everything from vans to B-doubles and a little bit of road train work. We've been doing a bit of oversize lately, um, starting to try to get in a bit of low loader stuff and, and really try to diversify and move everything that our clients need us to. Oh, I mean, we're, we're moving everything from one carton to 58, 60, 68 pallets, anywhere up to 85 pallets. We could move a whole warehouse if they needed us to, obviously not at once, but you know, if, if our clients require it, we're, we're happy to move as much as we need to. Oh, we've got a fairly large team now, um, and it's pretty diverse. We've got a bunch of drivers that can do vans, utes, rigids through to B-doubles and road train guys. Uh, we, have, we have plenty of drivers around, and I mean, if it comes to the point where we need to service a client, then even I can get in the truck and, uh, and get it done. Oh, I mean, compliance is a massive part of the road transport industry at the moment. So, um, and it always has been. It's just something that we really focus on. Uh, all of our drivers have a eight-step induction process. They're tested as a driver in front of myself. Um, we, we definitely spend a lot of time making sure that the drivers are well rested, uh, managing their fatigue properly, and not taking jobs on that would that would compromise their fatigue. Oh, I mean, one of the best things about this industry is the challenges. So there's a lot of challenges involved in transport and doing it effectively. So making sure that my client's freight arrives on time as you know, all the time and making sure that the little challenges that will arise for every job are dealt with promptly and fixed and the freight gets delivered as quickly as we possibly can. We're constantly compliant and it might sound like an easy easy thing to do, but especially vehicle maintenance is, is very challenging, takes a lot of time and we, we are very good at it now. We've really, really stepped up our game over the last sort of four or five years from as, as the industry's progressed. Um, you know, we, we have at, at any one time, we have anywhere up to 450 tyres on the road doing up to 1,000 kilometres a night. You know, just, just for example, tyre management can be a very challenging thing with 450 tyres doing 1,000 kilometres. As you can imagine, we change a fair few tyres. And making sure that they're all compliant within regulations is, is, a, is a challenge. And we have systems in place, which we spend a lot of time on, to make sure that that's all done correctly. Um, I'm not sure my wife's so happy about the kids loving the truck so much because uh, the weekends become a play in the truck day and, and clean a truck and polish a truck. And a lot of our family photos have things to do with trucks. But the boys really love it. And I really like that about the industry. Yeah, the, boy, the boys do like to get out there and if I'm, especially if I'm out moving trials around the yard or, or out playing in them. If I'm out playing in the yard with the trucks, the boys really do like to get, in, get involved in it. So. Oh, we can have clients anywhere. So we have clients from all over the country. Um, we have a lot of rural and country destination clients. Uh, as, as, as far as transport works, if, it's, if there's a road that goes there, we're able to access it. So... Um, you know, we do our best to service everybody the same. Uh, obviously, if you're in remote Queensland, it's a bit more difficult, but we, we've, we enjoy the challenge and, and make sure we get it done right. Yeah, so Main Freight's one of our, our major clients. Um, we do a lot of work for Main Freight and make sure that we obviously provide as many vehicles and top quality vehicles as we can for those guys. Um, and I mean, if you look at the Volvo here, this is the, the direction everybody's heading to. Um, well, we are anyway, especially. Uh, again, as I go into the compliance part, which is such a large part of the industry, uh, these vehicles with their gold service maintenance from Volvo, is there's just nothing beats it on it from our, our point of view anyway. Well, I just feel that uh, from, from our angle, and everyone has a different opinion, but Volvo's with the, the high quality, the service quality that we get from the gold maintenance, um, we have set pricing, but it's a very uh, thorough uh, system so these vehicles are, are fully maintained within the manufacturer's specifications so there's no corner cutting there's nothing that, that isn't done that is absolutely isn't perfect 
So we really work with the Volvos. Their fuel efficiency is great. Um, and obviously, honestly, mechanically, we don't have any issues with them. I take my kids in on the weekend and them enjoy what I do. So my, my wife and kids both all, all enjoy what we do as a family. Um, we really enjoy doing it. And it's nice to have something where it's, it's work, but my family also enjoy the, what we do. So as a, the family part of it, something that really, really makes my day. And also uh, the, the sense of joy you get when a difficult job gets done perfectly.